नमस्कार एंड हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल माय ट्यूटर आप सबका बहुत बहुत स्वागत है आपके अपने चैनल माय ट्यूटर पर इट्स ए रिक्वेस्ट दो सो न्यू टू माय चैनल काइंडली सब्सक्राइब एंड हिट द बेल आइकन सो दैट यू डोंट मिस द न्यू अपडेट्स सो लेट स्टार्ट विद आवर टूडेज टॉपिक हाउ टू मेक एन इंस्टेंस ऑफ एन ऑब्जेक्ट यूजिंग एन पार्टिकल्स इन माया सो लेट स्टार्ट गेट इन टू फाइल एंड आई ओपन माई फाइल विच इज ऑलरेडी क्रिएटेड so what we can see here is the serial box the bowl and each and everything is there also i have given some animation to my object also so that uh, we can get the serial flakes coming out of this small hole okay make sure our set menu is set into fx and i'll get into n particles click on fill objects it is 10 right now i'll just make it 15 and i'll say particle fill say close check it out everything is yeah it's filled with the particles correct so now if i'll play this definitely this particles are going to fall down like this so what i'll do here is i'll select the container or the box of the serial serial box and i'll get into and floor click on this create passive collider okay so now what i'll see here is this particles will remain inside the box okay so now next step is i'll get into n particles where few options are available which i'll change okay like i'll get into collision and i'll make it self collide number 1 and number 2 i'll get into shading and in that make this point as a spheres move on to the top get into particle size make it to i'll say 4 so that it becomes smaller size yes it is and uh, i'll say rewind and play so this is actually filled with those particles press 4 will come to know yes this is coming out one by one that's perfect so it is but obvious it is going to come like this only now instead of the sphere balls uh, or spherical shapes i need some objects which should look like uh, like serial flakes and that should be coming out of this box okay so for that what i'll do here is i'll make serials so i'll take the help of this torus that's okay so instead of the spheres i would like to have this as a serial okay so i'll just rename this now how to assign this object as an instance to this particles so in that case what we'll do is we'll select the shape first select the n particles get into n particles menu and just click on instancer over here okay so just click on instancer so now what we can see here is a good amount of particles which has been seen here this is since bigger in size that is the reason it is coming up like this so what i'll do here is i'll just scale this bit smaller yeah press four so that we can see this serials are coming down and falling in the bowl okay since the bowl is not defined as passive collider so it is not behaving like a bowl okay 
So I'll just go here and I click on create passive collider, rewind and play. So now we will see it very nicely. Those particles, those serial flakes are coming out and it is getting accumulated in the bowl, right? Okay. So now the next step is like, what I want is this is falling, this serial are falling very straight and it's getting accumulated. I want some kind of rotation in this particular serials, okay, with the particles. So I'll select the particles and uh, I'll go down. I have an option available where the rotation is there. I'll just click on compute rotation and uh, we have general it is in, inside instance of geometry just go down you got a rotation option available in that that rotation just go here and select rotation as a per particle attribute okay now if i'll say rewind and play what we can see here is all the objects will come down rotating i'll say tumbling down like this okay so very nicely it is coming up and it is the those particles or those serial are getting filled in the bowl correct so this is how it is going to come now if we wish to give some color definitely we can give color to this and uh, if we want to have some different combinations or i'll say different types of uh, serials like oh, oh this is one single type i want to have another shape also into this i can have that also so for an example i'll take this spear Okay, so I have two different different types of serials in this. So how to add this? How to add the another object also into this? So for that, oh, we should actually in the beginning itself, we should have uh, selected both this object and uh, should have assigned. So not a problem with that. What I can do is I can anytime go here and I can delete this instance which I have created already. So I have deleted those objects and what i'll do here is uh, selected both the objects hold the shift or control button and click on n particles and uh, get into n particle and just click on this instance so as soon as i click on this instance what i can see here is it's the same i can see only the Taurus type objects can be seen here, okay. But I can see the spherical type of objects or the serials, okay. So for that, what I'll do is I'll get back to Instancer again, and I'll see what is there. So what I can see here is I can see the serials as a sphere one. Yes, so both the objects are there, serial one and serial two, okay. So once I'll move this up, move up spherical. So this all these things will change to spherical. Look at this. Okay. You can see this. So for this, what should be done so that uh, it should have randomly place in our scene. So for that, what I'll do is I'll get into n particles. We'll write a small script for this. I'll just rename this. serial per particle attribute and I'll say add okay so now this is added I'll say close so we can find it out over here the serial is added okay so now next step is get into expression okay so get into serial right click on this and get into creation expression I'll just copy this value paste it 
very small and simple script will it will be that is a random and will define what values to be there and uh, how many number of objects to be are there so this two means there are two types of objects which is to be there in the serial okay so i will say create and i will say close so now i'll just say rewind and play let us check we should be able to see two different types of serials should be coming out but it is not the reason behind this is we need to put some extra settings or values which needs to be changes okay so i'll get into n particle and uh, there is an option available which we need to change like for an example i'll just 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 here at object index there i'm supposed to search for that option serial okay so once that is changed or once that is selected so we can see here in the box those objects are have changed got it so i'll say rewind and play one more time so now this is coming out if i'll just give some color value changes to these objects definitely it is going to accept those values also so i'll get into assign new material simple just nothing i'll say give blend and i'll just change the color to say kind of brown or little orange shade take this to this also i'll assign new material surface take it as a plane and to, even to this i'll take somewhat this light colors okay so this is changed so definitely you will find those colors on your objects also if we don't want wish to see these particles what i can do here is at any point of time i can get back to this render type attributes i'll make it as a points so that those objects are not visible and what i can see is simple the objects whatever i have defined so what we can see here is those serials which i have actually looking for and it is getting filled in my bowl okay so this is how it is coming up and uh, this is not getting rotated i'll just check it out might be since i have deleted the previous and it is not yet change yeah so i'll just change that make it as rotation per particle so this will come up very nicely now this will actually give you the feel of serial balls so this 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 spherical shapes looks like peanuts and uh, this is like uh, serial rings okay and this can be rendered also so i'll just show you how it will be seen after rendering this is how it is coming up so i'll just press one so that everything is at the original level so i'll go here into modeling and i'll just apply smoothness to my object I will even this also I'll apply some smoothness right so this looks very nice and uh, also I'll add some lights also into this scene so get into create and uh, add a light like a kind of area light Turn into look through selected.
press 7 to see the effect of the light I'll make a little change in color like say a little bluish also if you wish to have the shadows in this we can create the shadows also okay so this is how it is coming up i hope you understood how to make an instance of objects using n particle in maya so subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for new upcoming videos click on thumbs up for like and share it with your friends if any queries write it in the comment box thank you so much for watching my video milte hain kuch aur extra different tricks ke sath agle video mein thank you